the little solar panel, the fairy lights that come with the little solar panels, I could hang it right over the edge of that rail right there and just bring it down behind and wrap. And it would have, it would, you know, could even sit out here for Christmas. Hey guys, it's a, it's a rainy day. Um, you can see the water here in my driveway. Um, I left Katie and it's also overcast. So I feel like I could take my glasses off of them and be squinching my eyes. So, um, I left Katie and, um, Honey and Jensen in Katie's little yard. And me and Levi left. We were literally gone 45 minutes. That's it, tops. We went straight to, to Tractor Supply, got two bales of hay, and came straight home with one side stop at, um, my nose is wondering, Dollar General for a gallon of milk because this rain is supposed to be starting and then you have lulls in it and then it'll start again. There's supposed to be some thunderstorms involved. And I'm just like, I do not, tomorrow's gonna be worse than today. So I was like, well, might as well, if I gotta go get hay, might as well grab some milk because I've got about a half a gallon and she's drinking three bottles a day. In fact, she's due for a bottle right now, but she's eating. So um, I have a video, it may have come out today, where I showed her food bowl. And this little side of her bowl where she had eaten down a good section. So I'm trying to get it where she can get a few more hours between a bottle. So, um, but what I want to do right now is a review. So some of you guys that don't like reviews, you don't have to watch it. Just, but it's, um, from Wayfair and it's, um, and I cannot say this word. It, I don't know if it's the country in me, topiary, topiary topiary trees and I believe I asked there was two that you could get a boxwood or a cypress I believe I asked for the cypress I have not opened the box it's right here and I'm fixing to open that right now oh y'all see that I was cleaning my porch earlier um I usually around spring I do a pour the bleach and then sweep it into the floor because my floor is blue and there's places where the the paint's coming up in places but um i wanted to go ahead and do this today before i set these trees that way i don't have to move them and then put them back and stuff so i got all here in front of the door cleaned i got the door cleaned i got the bottom of the door where the dogs are always scratching to get in i got it all cleaned and it's pretty, you can see the difference between, where's my hand, right there, shiny blue, shiny blue in front of the mat, shiny blue here, and then you get it further out and you start seeing it get dark again. Cause I, I only had like this much bleach in the bottom of my thing. So in the next couple of days, I will get the whole porch bleached and clean. But I wanted to do this little section before I opened um, this box and sat them up. So now all this has been dusted down around so that I won't be dusting and dropping, you know, um, cobwebs and stuff in the little trees. So I'm ready to do this real quick. And um, they're two and a half foot artificial topiary trees. It comes in a two pack. They're from Wayfair. And I just sent, I believe that she sent me a link already and a code for a discount but i can't remember and i was looking through my emails and I couldn't find it so i just sent her an email today saying if she sent it i can't find it i'm so sorry please resend me the link and the code for you guys anybody that's interested so i'm gonna get these open real quick and show y'all how pretty they are so give me one second to get my knife out and get them open all right i didn't open it yet I'm going to let y'all be with me when I open it. I'm be gentle here. But I've had the box for a couple of weeks here on the porch. Um, oh, yeah, it's cypress. Oh, and it looks like they've got 
even though it's stoppers, they've got these little cones on them, like a pine cone. That's cute. Anyway, I knew that I wanted to get this out of the way. And any of you guys that are getting ready to do any kind of spring decorating and stuff like that, these might be interesting to you and something that you might would want. Here's some moss to go around the bottom of the little pot. And like I said, there's two trees in here. They're actually sort of heavy. They're pretty heavy. Where's my cutter? Alright. Oh, I'm going to sit this one up over here and then come back. Oh, it's so Oh, really cute. All right, did you see it down there? Um, let me put the moss in it. Can y'all see good enough of me? There. I am gonna put the moss in the bottom and you have to open the tree up a little bit. Uh, Sort of downward and it's opening them. Oh, I knocked the pine cone off. Oh, yeah, that's really cute. Oh, yeah, isn't that pretty? All right, let me get it. It gets so full when you pull it out of the, when you get it open. And remember, if any of you are interested in these for any kind of front porch or back porch, a deck, um, a, uh, what do you call it? I, I, I want to say breezeway, and that's not what I mean. But you know how sometimes you have, if it's a little bit of a fancier house, you have that area that's completely covered. You sort of have a walkway that comes up and you're completely covered before you get to the front door. I don't know what I would, here in the country, we just call them porches, but it's not what I mean because they're really not really big enough to have chairs and stuff sitting on them. But sometimes you can decorate just the, the front entrance. All right, let me put this moss in this one. Now, the only problem I'm gonna have is Katie. So, Katie may be done on the front porch. I do tend to put Katie on the front porch at night after she's had her night bottle because uh, she's just right here at the door and I leave her out for a few minutes so she can take care of any business. And it's actually done really good doing that because she doesn't have any accidents, which are not accidents for a goat. It's just what a goat does. But her her cage has been nice and clean in the mornings. Oh my gosh, this is just a pretty little tree. And you know what? I don't have to water it. I don't have to water it. I mean, I love my little vegetable garden in the summer, and you know, you have to water, and, but these, I will not have to water them. 
I'm gonna have to sweep around them now because they've got some. Let me back up. I can't go down the steps because I'm gonna be rained in, rained on. All right, this one's got a little less point. Let me get some points popped up on it. All right. So they're adorable. I'm so glad I agreed. I haven't been doing it. I think y'all know if y'all any of y'all noticed. I haven't done a lot of reviews lately. I know there's a lot of people that love the reviews and it gives them good ideas. And there's a lot of people that just don't like a review. In my mind, I always say, well, if you love my channel, you'll like a review because I'm not just filming it sitting over there talking about it and you can you see it in my life the way i'm going to use it and then you'll see in my life if i decide to change rohan looking out the window if you decide to change if i decide to change how i'm using it then you get to see that too because all of a sudden you'll see it in a different place or a different area so um if you are thinking about getting any little plants for your porch then you don't want to have to worry about watering them i'm going to go down in the, in the rain it's just a sprinkle let me step down right here they look really cute i love them i can't wait till i get the rest of my porch clean yeah all right guys so these were um they're two pack and from wayfair and i will put the link and the discount code in the um, description of the video. So y'all check them out because they are really cute and really easy and they're heavy. They were uh, pretty dadgum heavy. There's not just a wind going to blow them over. They're, they've got some they've got some weight. I can't even pick them up one handed. I'm scared of them. Yeah, they're, I could but I'm not going to pull anything out. They're, they're heavy. So wind is not gonna blow them over. All right, so y'all check these out. Check out the links if it's something you would think you would like on your porch or your deck or your front entrance. Even though they're fake, they, they, they're not like you couldn't stick them out by the road. Like if you have a really pretty gate entrance, that would be pretty and you never have to worry about them. No drought, no rainstorms nothing's gonna hurt them nothing's gonna mess them up because they ain't real all right i like them and i was thinking since they are this dark green like this wouldn't it look pretty with some like little christmas lights in them at come christmas time you wouldn't have to change out any decor you would just add some really cute maybe even some fairy lights that are battery operated are some fairy lights like in my case i could take fairy lights it would be harder in this one because it's inside but that one over there i could put a little solar panel the fairy lights that come with little solar panels i could hang it right over the edge of that rail right there and just bring it down behind and wrap and it would have it would, you know could even sit out here for christmas so i'm really i, I really love them they're really cute I don't have to worry about them and I can use them for different holidays. That's pretty awesome. So I will like once again I'm gonna let y'all know that I'm gonna post this link to these little trees. Topiary two pack. And you can choose from I went cypress, but they also had boxwood. Alright, love you guys. God bless y'all. See you later. Katie, I'm trying to do a video.